Welcome to the Business Source Complete Thesaurus Tutorial. Using the thesaurus is a good way to start your search to ensure that you find the best articles containing the concepts you are researching. The thesaurus is a set of librarian-created tags that describe what articles are about. We select the thesaurus link. We enter our first search concept, Environmental Marketing, in the browse box. The thesaurus shows us the correct subject heading is Green Marketing, so we click on that link. We click on the Green Marketing link again. The new page displays the scope note, which tells us how Business Source Complete defines the term Green Marketing. It also displays Green Marketing in the context of broader terms, related terms, and the terms for which it is used. We decide Green Marketing is the term we want and click the checkbox. If we were combining more than one thesaurus term at this point, we would have to decide whether to combine them using AND, OR, or NOT. AND would find articles with both headings, giving us fewer results, OR would find articles with either heading, giving us more results, and NOT would eliminate articles containing the selected headings. We click the ADD button. The search box shows that we are searching for articles with the descriptor Green Marketing. The search gives us 1,095 results. We return to the thesaurus to find the term for our second search concept. We type International Marketing and Browse. The correct thesaurus term is Export Marketing, so we select it. We click Export Marketing to show its scope note and related terms. Clicking Explode expands the search to include both Export Marketing and its narrower terms, in this case Communication and Export Marketing, giving us more results. We decide not to explode the search and click the Export Marketing checkbox. And click the Add button. And search. This gives us 4,228 results. We click the triangle to open the search history alerts. And select the checkbox next to our first search. Our second search is still in the search box, so we click the Search with AND button. This will combine the two searches and look for only articles with both subject terms. We toggle shut the search history alerts to display our results. Unfortunately, we have only one result. This sometimes happens when we combine thesaurus terms. We'll open our search history and go back to our first set of results by clicking on the link. We close the search history and select Advanced Search. Rather than using a subject heading, we'll enter a keyword, in this case Europe, in the search box. We hide the left column to give us more space. This search produces 17 hits, a manageable number. If we want to search another market area, say China, we just replace the keyword and redo the search. Remember that the default keyword search looks everywhere in the article for the word, so the chances of false hits are increased. This ends the Business Source Complete Thesaurus search tutorial.